Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we are going to find the area of the given triangle with these vertices. And for that purpose, we will be using this formula to find the area of the triangle, which is equal to 1 over 2 times this box. And by the way, this box is called the determinant of a 3 by 3 matrix. Once again, we are going to call this one a determinant. Now let's focus at our vertices A, B, and C. I am going to call this vertex A with its, with its coordinates x1, y1, and the coordinates for B equals to x2, y2, and likewise for C, x3, y3. Then we can write our this area of a triangle formula in terms of points A, B, and C as I have wrote down over here. So these vertices could be nicely written as in this determinant as I can write negative 2, negative 7, 5, 6, negative 6, negative 2 and these entries on the right hand side column are simply 1's. And now in the next step we are going to evaluate this determinant which I have copied it down over here. Let's find the value of this determinant. Let me show you a really simple way to find the value of this determinant. Just draw the horizontal line right up right above this bottom row and let's crisscross right now. Let's multiply negative 2 times 6 is negative 12. Then we put a minus sign right before anything else and let's crisscross multiply this way. Negative 7 times 5 is negative 35. So that's going to make a negative 12 plus 35. That is going to give us 23. So this 23 is going to go in the opposite side right up here and now let's crisscross these next two columns negative 7 times 1 is negative 7 let's put a minus sign 1 times 6 is 6 so that's going to make a negative 13 this negative 13 is going to go in the opposite side as well and now let's focus on this column, the very first column, negative 2, 5. Let's copy and paste negative 2, 5 right up here and let's crisscross. 1 times 5 is 5 minus negative 2 times 1 is negative 2. So that's going to make 5 plus 2 is 7. This 7 is going to go in the middle. Let's now multiply these individual numbers, these numbers, these numbers, and these number, and then we can add them up. So that is going to make negative 6 times negative 13 is 78 minus 14 plus 23 equals to 80. Seven. So the value of this determinant turns out to be 87. So thus the area of this given triangle is going to be a simply 1 over 2 times the value of this determinant we figured out which is 87. So that is when we multiply 1 over 2 times 87 that is going to be 43.5. So thus the area of this triangle turns out to be 43.5 square unit and just keep in your mind that the area is always positive. 
And here is your assignment. Can you do this problem on your own now? You can take your time. Luckily, I have already uploaded this video as well. Please go ahead and check it out and see the correct answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.